this is the joint here that we're looking at? Yeah. yeah. And we're going to use waves to drive electric current in the plasma. You need the current for confinement. Yeah. I need to talk with you about the D3D stuff too, actually. Talk about the process, talk about yeah. different things. I'm like, that I can do with. Um, well, fusion is kind of a quest for a new energy source, sort of like, you know, when we first made fire, that was one way to keep ourselves warm. Now we're talking about going to, uh, we went to burning coal, we burned wood, and now we want to bring light hydrogen atoms together and produce energy. So that would be, it's much greener in the sense that it doesn't require hydrocarbons burning something, but it would be the equivalent of doing a nuclear reactor, a fission reactor, with hydrogen, so we don't have as much of the long-term radioactive nuclear waste that we have with uh, with fission. And the other benefit, yes. Yeah, so this is a very big deal. You want to transfer. You want to go from being fossil fuel based, which is putting carbon and CO2 in the air, carbon monoxide in the air, and you want to then move to something that's not uh, going to be adding to the greenhouse effect, which is a very big deal. And fusion would have one of the smallest footprints you can make for decarbonization. Right. This would be the equivalent of bringing um, what they call base capacity to, whereas some of the things like wind or solar will be peaking or niche type things. This will be your rock, this will replace your coal fired plant and really replace that with it.